Our marijuana journey takes us to Digipath Labs, where science is very serious and very sterile. And we have to put on jackets. Any marijuana sold in the Valley has to pass muster at labs like this. Todd Denkin is the CEO. If we're going to call this stuff medicine, right, we have to treat it like medicine. And here they do, putting marijuana under the microscope of one and a half million dollars worth of scientific equipment. Last week, the state clarified the scientific standard labs like this must follow, which means testing can begin. I think that the industry will be up and running within the next six months. Over at Euphoria, getting started would make them, well, euphoric. All this dispensary needs is pot. You can't um, have product in here until you can actually open. All your product has to get tested by the labs. So we're just waiting for a lab to be available here in Las Vegas to test our product. Is that the big bottleneck? Yes. But bottleneck no more. Euphoria expects to be open by the end of the month. How busy do you think you are going to get? Um, well, right now we're getting 20 to 30 phone calls a day. So we're going to be probably pretty busy, especially in the beginning. Lawmakers passed dispensaries in 2013. 21 dispensaries have been approved in the county, Henderson and Las Vegas. North Las Vegas has 14 applications on the table. Medical marijuana is here. Digipass, Todd Denkin. I think about a year from now, we will be in full production. So there will be harvests happening, there will be stores filled with product, and all of that will happen. I think it'll take about a year.